Hey Kevin, it's Colin. Okay, so I updated the site, and I think more than anything, it was probably you probably did everything right. Um, the DWT was updated. The responsive CSS wasn't in there, so I replaced that one. But you had mentioned you, the files you put on the sandbox weren't quite there. But I think if more than anything, just to, because you have so many files in the site, when you updated the DWT, it didn't sort of propagate through all the pages. So I just I actually did it about four or five times just to make sure that it had gone through all the pages. I counted 48. So, um, But it's all the other files because Dreamweaver goes through and reads every single file, including image files in your site, to see if, oh, is this something that he's updating or not? Um, and, you know, the bigger the site, the slower the process. And sometimes it just takes a couple of kicks at it to get it rolling. But anyways, while I was in there, I made some tweaks anyways. <coughs> Uh, so let's get into the mobile sort of view here. This is sort of what your mobile view is going to look like right about here. The menu is actually, this is not what it's going to look like. It's going to turn into like a button. Um, it doesn't, but this will give you a pretty good idea. Um, change the picture to more of a mobile picture, the same picture you're using for your, um, for your Nevo slider large. Reorganize the graphic logo, the text logo, and the... Um, tagline so they line up and it's re sort of repositioned and resized the things also I enabled the three boxes here because I noticed you had content in there that was probably important to your site and your mobile viewers but the images I disabled and one of the reasons I do that or suggest we do that in mobile anyways is you've got a picture up at the top which sort of gives people an idea of what the site's all about um, Hopefully you want to get your mobile users to get the gist of what your site's about without having to go through a whole bunch of scrolling. The more pictures you have on a mobile device, the more scrolling you're going to do. Ideally, and what we've tried to do in, in terms of creating a minimalistic layout for mobile users is to get the text and the content to them quickly and efficiently without having to download a lot of extra stuff, especially if they're uh, not on Wi-Fi and they're using their own data usage. Uh, the more crap they have to download, excuse my <laughs> language there, the more stuff they have to download on a mobile device, the more expensive it's going to be for them in the long run if they don't have a good plan. So, Anyways, I'm uploading this back to the sandbox for you. So you can just re-download the entire site. Um, and what you could do is you could essentially just re-download the entire site from the sandbox and publish it right up to your server. You could re-download it and overwrite your existing files, but because it's a, I've updated all the pages, what I suggest is take your existing local site that you have, zip it up, store it away somewhere. Take the site on the sandbox, download it to a new folder, and then redefine the site in Dreamweaver. Define it as a brand new site, like it's just like it's a brand new template. And then you can publish that up to your, your live server afterwards. 